for his analysis on a fiery question time and the other big stories making headlines today. I want to bring in the national editor of the Australian newspaper, Mr Dennis Shanahan. Thank you for your time, Dennis. Uh, let's start with Anthony Albanese. He went hard at the PM in question time over building purpose-built quarantine facilities and setting up mRNA vaccine manufacturing onshore. You get the sense Labor sees an opportunity here to renew its attack on the government's pandemic management, but it's also an opportunity for Scott Morrison, isn't it? Uh, yes. Uh, look, uh, it is clear that Labor took the opportunity of the Omicron appearance to be able to say, well, look, uh, previously uh, the government hasn't done the job on quarantine it was too slow on vaccine. Now, of course, this line about the vaccination falls over, uh, as the government correctly points out, uh, that we're in the leading rates of vaccination in the world. Uh, we have one of the lowest death rates in the world, and our economic recovery is actually one of the strongest in the world as well. So Labor was struggling on that uh, basis. But with the appearance of Omicron now, we still it's still too early yet to know exactly what sort of a threat it uh, poses, and every time we do see a new variant, we do have to treat it seriously, as if it may be serious, because if it is and we don't treat it seriously, it can be extremely dangerous. But the point here is that Labor was going back to its lines earlier in the year. Scott Morrison had failed on quarantine and failed on vaccination. Uh, I think the quarantine issue, given that the, the symptoms uh, appear to be milder, uh, with the Omicron, uh, and that the people who uh, have been, uh, some of the people who have been uh, uh, tested positive are actually in the Howard Springs quarantine uh, station, uh, yeah. it sort of, it, it removes that strength that was there earlier with Labor's argument. So I think that Scott Morrison is now saying, well, here we are, this is a chance for us to talk about the success of the coalition's uh, mm. COVID-19 response both on health and on the economy. So, yes, look, it has been a bit of a spike uh, for Labor, uh, but it's also meant a better question time for uh, Scott Morrison today than the chaos of last week.